Facing the Safari could not install a profile due to unknown error message on your iPhone can be annoying. This problem usually occurs when you're trying to install configuration profiles and may be caused by network issues or certain restrictions. To help you fix this, here are some troubleshooting steps you can try. Solution 1. Check your internet connection. Ensure your iPhone is connected to a stable Wi-Fi or cellular network. Swipe down from your iPhone's top to open the control center and see if your Wi-Fi or mobile data is connected. If you are connected to Wi-Fi, then switch to mobile data and then go back to Wi-Fi once again to see if it's connecting properly or not. If you are connected to mobile data, then go to Wi-Fi and then after connecting to Wi-Fi, disable Wi-Fi and go back to mobile data to see if your problem is fixed by that. If that did not fix your problem, then turn on airplane mode for about 20 seconds and after that time has passed, toggle off airplane mode. This will refresh your network for a bit and hopefully fix your problem as well. But if the problem was not fixed, then move on to the advanced solutions. Solution number two, restart Safari and your iPhone. For this, you have to swipe up from your control panel and see if Safari is open in the background. If you find Safari in the background, simply swipe it up to close it completely. And then you have to restart your iPhone. After you have restarted your iPhone by doing this or using the power button, check if your issue has been fixed or not. If not, then try solution number three, which will be clearing Safari cache and website data. For this, you have to go to your phone settings and scroll down. Then tap on apps and search for Safari. It's usually here. So once you have found it, tap on it and then scroll down and on the history and website data section, tap on clear history and website data. Then you have to tap on clear history and this will clear every history of your Safari browser in the background and everything. And after that, you can also scroll down and tap on advanced and then tap on website data and let for this page to load. It usually takes a bit of time to load in some cases, but so don't worry about it. Let it load. So once it's loaded, just tap on remove all website data and confirm it by tapping remove now. And this will remove all the website data of your Safari browser and hopefully fix the issue. But the issue, if the issue was still not fixed, then you can try solution four, check for restrictions. Go to your phone settings and scroll down, tap on screen time, and then scroll down once again and tap on content and privacy restrictions. So if you find this being toggled on like this, and you have to go to allowed apps and features and see if Safari has been allowed or not, then you have to go back and then scroll down and tap on accounts and make sure that accounts has been set to allowed. If it was set to don't allow, simply set it to allowed like this. And after that, check if your issue has been fixed or not. If not, then try the last solution, which will be updating your iOS. For this, you have to go to your settings and tap on general. Then tap on software update. So if you find any software updates available for your iOS, simply update your phone to the latest OS version. And after doing that, your problem should be fixed for good. So guys, that's how you fix the Safari could not install a profile due to unknown error on your iPhone. If the problem persists, consider contacting Apple support for further help. And I hope you guys, you guys have found this video helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.